Police are looking for the suspects after a Brooklyn bishop is robbed of more than a million dollars in jewelry, and the incident was caught on camera during a live stream. That's right. Bishop Lamar Whitehead was delivering a sermon yesterday morning when he noticed the gun-wielding intruders. Police say the suspects targeted the bishop and his wife. No one was hurt, thankfully. Lisa Evers is in Canarsie with what the bishop had to say after this horrifying ordeal. Lisa. Well, Stephen Laurie, this well-known Brooklyn Bishop Lamar Whitehead holds his Sunday services in the space you see right behind me, with some of the faithful coming in person and many more watching his sermons via live stream. But on Sunday, his sermon was interrupted when armed robbers burst in. Yo, yo, all right, right, right. On Sunday, as Bishop Lamar Whitehead delivered his sermon for his Leaders of Tomorrow ministry, police say three masked gunmen stormed in and rushed right for the bishop. They took more than $1 million worth of gold jewelry and gems, including a Rolex watch from the bishop and his wife. When I see them come into the sanctuary with their guns, I told everybody, get out. No shots were fired. People here are stunned. It was just shocking to know that in this neighborhood something like that is, would happen. And it's thrilling for the people that come to church that day. It's horrible. We just, it's sad to know what's going on in the world right now. The armed robbers ran out and then police say jumped into a white Mercedes for their getaway. Bishop Whitehead was in the news last May for attempting to negotiate the surrender of murder suspect Andrew Abdullah, wanted for the Q train shooting that took the life of Daniel Enriquez, who was on his way to Sunday brunch. Whitehead drove his $400,000 Rolls Royce to the 5th Precinct, but the NYPD took Abdullah into custody without his help. Whitehead has had his own contact with the criminal justice system, serving five years behind bars for identity theft and grand larceny. You know, it's my prerogative to purchase what I want to purchase. If I worked hard for it, I can purchase what I want to purchase. Now, Mayor Adams took on the role of mentor to Bishop Whitehead when he was released from prison to help him turn his life around. He told the Daily News he'll do whatever is necessary to find those responsible. The NYPD tells us that a 911 call was made from the location and that this investigation is ongoing. We're live in Canarsie. I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News.